What's up guys, welcome back to Unbox Junkie. My name is Matt and today we've got the J Buds Air by J Lab. Now a while back we looked at the J Lab Epic Air and they're pretty cool. They were two wireless earbuds but they were kind that had that loop. You can check out that video right here or I'll leave a link down in the description below. Now first off the J Buds are Bluetooth 5.0, big plus. They have an auto on and connect which basically means once you've had it paired up to your phone, you stick them in the case, it'll shut off automatically. Once you take them out of the case, it'll automatically turn on and reconnect to your phone again. So that's really handy. Now it does have three equalizer modes. You've got the J Lab Signature, which would amplify vocals and bass, Balance, which is an even sound, Bass Boosted, which is amplified bass and sub bass. Now they're saying that it's everyday proof. It's IP55 rated, which basically means it's resistant to dust and water jet spray from any angle. So you won't have to worry about uh, crying on these or, or running in the rain. I probably wouldn't shower with them, but they yeah, they'll probably stand up to a shower if you wanted to wear them in the shower. You probably could. You can make calls because it does have a microphone built in. Now, it's got 14 plus hours of playtime. Now, that means that it has three to four hours of battery life in the earbuds themselves, but the charge case gives you an additional 10 hours, so it'll last you most of the day. Oh, nice. You get the advanced controls right on the box, so there's no guessing. We got an instruction manual, very well illustrated. All right, so you fold that down, you get your different size ear cups. You got the charge case, oh, oh, that's cool. So the charge case actually comes with its own USB cable, so you don't even have to worry about lugging one around with you. You flap that out, stick it right in a USB port, you're good to go, very nice. Then you got your LED indicator lights right here on the front. Fully dry off J-Bud air before placing inside charging case. Oh, there we go. Looks like we got our Cush fins. They're calling these cush fin. Get off of me. They're calling these cush fins. As soon as you close it or open it, the lights actually come on to show you how much charge the case has. All right. They're a little thicker, a little taller than I thought they would be, but nonetheless, they're really nice. Of course, they got their logo on everything, even the ear cups. I don't know if you guys can even see that, but then you got your LED indicator. It looks like your microphone is right there on the front. Now, the logo is the button, and it's clicky. They got left and right written on the back. There we go. So the cush fins, they go on there like that. And it's just to give your give this space here a little more of a snug fit. Let's try it out. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, I like that cush fin. That's nice. Not bad. Oh, they don't stick out too bad. They have a nice seal to them, though. Oh, that's too long. Oh. It's too long. Oh, they're already pairing together. Okay, cool. So I put them in the case and then I took them out and they're already paired together. See the white light? That means that they're paired together. The right one is the master, so that one's flashing blue, so you only need to connect that one to the phone. Wow, this thing's got some bass. Oh, I'm liking that. Yes. Okay, first off, I'm, already, I'm only on the second song and I already don't feel them. These things are so comfortable. Yeah, the only thing these are missing are like a, is a pass-through. If these had a pass-through, you can wear them all day. You never even know they're there. All right, I'm gonna try uh, the equalizer. Let's see. So the equalizer works really well. The J Lab signature is really the way to go. That is the best of both worlds because you get your bass boosted, but it's got a nice balance as well. Overall power is a little bit higher than the rest of them. I really like that mode. Balanced is what it is. It kind of tones things down just a little bit, but it's a nice equal playing field for the whole like audio range. And then bass boosted is the same as balanced, just with the bass kicked up. Okay, so uh, double press. Brings up Google. Hey Google, how are you? <laughs> wow, that works really well. Same thing with Siri or pretty much any other voice assistant. I'm definitely liking that. All right, let's try another song. Let's do a little bass boosted. It would only feel right. So now bass boosted, especially this song, it's got a very low bass and these are picking up the low bass really well, which tells me that they use some pretty premium drivers in these. And it's nice and clear, even at max volume. I've got, I've got the phone, I think I got the phone. Yeah, I got the phone at max volume and I got the buds at max volume and it's loud. At first it was a little loud, but it doesn't get distorted at all. It sounds really good. There's no latency and they sound really good. Rhett and Lake are coming through really nice and clear. I'm gonna do a distance check. I will be right back. This chair got all moved. All right, uh, so I got about 50 feet or so. Yeah, I give or take a couple feet and then it started cutting out. All right, let's make a phone call. It's ringing in this ear only. Cool, can use it independently, nice. Hey, I'm, in, I'm shooting a video. 
I'm testing out some earbuds. Uh, I need you to tell me how how good I sound. Do I sound like I'm on something? Sound like I'm on the, just talking on the phone or what? Okay, but you're on speakerphone. Oh, okay, okay. But it sounds good. All right, cool. Yeah. He, now he was on speakerphone. He was driving, which that's actually good. He said it sounded really good. We actually talked for probably a good five minutes just then. So pros and cons. Um, there's not really many cons. There's only one con that I can really see. So they paired together but the right one is the one that pairs to your phone, which means that you can use the right one by itself, but you can't use the left one by itself. Bummer. The pros, they're super comfortable. I will say that, they are super comfortable. They make a really nice seal. They have a good range of volume. They do not get to the point where it's too loud to listen to. The sound comes through nice and clear. Everything sounds really good. There's no latency when you're watching something. So that's a big plus. It's got a nice stable Bluetooth 5.0 connection. The multiple functions and the buttons, they're gonna take a little getting used to, like I said before, but there's a lot of built-in functionality that is actually really handy. And it's all really about one, two, and three clicks and then and then you got hold but other than that it's really really super simple to operate and not only that but the biggest pro is that they're only 50 bucks all right guys that is it i'm gonna leave a link down in the description below as usual i leave it in your hands but as for now get out of here